Hey guys, it's Phoenix. Today I'm on 18w11a, this is the new 1.13 snapshot. I wanted to show you guys how to summon in your own ships in Minecraft. And we actually have one just over here, if I can find it. So this is a sideways shipwreck that has merged itself with the gravel right here. But there is a way for you to summon them in on your own. What you want to recognize here is, of course, if you want to summon a back half ship, you should probably summon the front half ship. And I'll show you guys how you can do this uh, with the fullest capabilities. Um, there's obviously the full type, but that's significantly smaller than these two combined. So if you're on a larger ship, you might want to do those two. You can have the degraded versions or the dilapidated versions. Same thing with the sideways ones, upside down ones. And this is just your full ship with the mast. Of course, you would have seen that at the beginning of this video. Okay, so that being said, what you want to do is type in your back half version. So shipwreck slash, because this is the folder that this is within. And then right side up underscore back half. So that's the first type of shipwreck available. And over here, you have the front half version. In practice, you will type in negative 23 for the relative position. Uh, the reason for this is because I am facing the negative Z version here. That's sort of important. You want to be within the Z axis because they'll spawn in that way. However, because the shipwreck on the front half is 23 blocks long, you want to offset the summoning of this ship, this part of the ship, 23 blocks in the negative Z direction. And that will cause this structure to form. Now, I don't know why that is the degraded version, because this ship is not degraded. I think there's a bit of a bug with structure blocks, so they're not fully functioning that way. Okay, so now I have um, another example of the same type of ship. So you can see it's not degraded here, so I don't know why that says degraded. Although instead of negative 23 here, I've typed in negative 21. The purpose of this is to allow this side of the front half ship to overlap onto this side. So you can see here there's a bit of a gap, and I don't want that. You could build this in yourself to fix it, but I've just made it overlap, and it overlaps perfectly. So this is the degraded version, and you can see this part of the ship is missing. It's broken. I don't know the ship lingo, so don't. I'm not going to even try. Uh, this is the upside down ship, upside down underscore front half. You can see that I have uh, offset it negative five blocks down in the y direction, or five blocks down. So it looks like it's actually submerged. And you can see that's exactly what I've done. And it's negative 19 for the upside down version because the ship is actually smaller. Um, and you can see that is the case. If I jump across to this side, part of it is missing. Uh, this is a sideways variant, and it is negative 21. So just like the other one, not the upside down version. So those are the major types of ships, and obviously with that being said, you can see that I've summoned in a fleet of ships, and this one's the one with the mast. Uh, and depending on the location in which you summon it, it will spawn in the masts with different block pallets. Um, there's obviously jungle trapdoors, jungle wood. Um, I think it depends on the Z axis and X axis. The Y axis will not matter. And uh, the masts aren't the only blocks with the variants here. You can see that the entire base of the ship has spruce planks here, and this is the jungle variant. So um, the palette is consistent across the different types. Otherwise, that is how you do it. So simply you have a structure block in place, load it in, and update it with a block of redstone so it will summon in. Make sure you press the done button. I don't know why pressing enter will not update the structure block. You need to press the done button. Overall, this is a wonderful snapshot. I think the addition of shipwrecks will even further entice players to explore the ocean. Um, we already have the ruins, which I can see a lot of. Even the fish themselves already add a lot to the environment here. I'm going to play around with a little bit more, just a quick video, showing you guys how to summon in your own ships, because if you're very bored of building your own ships, just use a structure block and you can decorate it uh, to what your heart desires. Thank you all for watching, leave a like, subscribe for more creative content, and use updates. Take care.